Join me on the fourth annual homecoming and pilgrimage to Sierra Leone on December 28, 2021 through January 9, 2022. We will be exploring this beautiful country and eligible individuals will be receiving Sierra Leonean citizenship and passports. For more details, check out our website, sierraleonepilgrimage.com or subscribe to our YouTube channel, Go Ham Lifestyle Vlogs. Because we all need an Africa escape plan. Hello fam, welcome back to the African Diaspora News Channel. I am Ungil Zalale, bringing you this report. Today's report is about a former Polish runner coming for our African sister that is from Namibia, Christine Mboma. He came for her and he said she needs to get a gender test because he does not believe she's a woman. Yeah, he actually said that. And of course, we know that she's a woman, but he's saying that because she's fast and she's winning. Imagine she's only 18 years old. This 44 year old man is coming for her and telling her that she should take a gender exam. Just imagine that. Being a woman, born a woman, and somebody is saying, mm, I don't believe that you're a woman. Like, just imagine how she must feel. But I don't think it should matter because she's getting her medals, she's winning, and that's all that matters. What gets to me with this is the hypocrisy. They will allow a whole transgender woman to compete in the weightlifting game in the Olympics, but they want to question if an African woman is running for her country make it make sense how does that make sense in the olympics transgender women are being allowed to compete and they're telling our sisters they need to get a gender test how disrespectful is that is he trying to say that she looks like a man is he trying to say you can't be that fast if you're a woman is that his point if that is his point, how come we didn't hear him speak up about the transgender woman that is competing in the weightlifting challenge in the Olympics? Oh no, that's a white, that's a white person. And he has a problem when it's a Namibian woman. That's, that's what gets to me, the hypocrisy. This girl won fair and square. She is 18 years old. She is talented and we need to give her her flowers. Well done to her. But this Polish man is trying to tell an 18 year old, I told you he's 44 years old. Just the disrespect, get a gender test. I don't believe that you're a woman. It's, yeah, <laughs> this is insane in my opinion because the double standards are clear. When it's a black woman, it's okay to ask if you're a woman or a man. But if, if it goes the other way around and it's a white person, you want to be careful. You don't want to misgender anyone, would you? This world sometimes does not make sense to me. Anyways, we would love to hear what your thoughts are on this. I am Angir Zalal, I'm bringing you this report. I will see you on the next one. Bye. Thank you for watching make sure to subscribe to our youtube channel and download the african diaspora news channel app now available on google play and the apple app store